you know that Amazon has a huge outlet section hidden on their website? And I went a little crazy. I built an entire summer wardrobe, eight outfits for $150. That's less than one pair of jeans from Revolve.com or like one new swimsuit from Victoria's Secret. <laughs> Pretty much everything I have here was under $10. We all wanna look cute every time a new season rolls around, but sometimes we're just balling on a budget. So today I'm gonna show you exactly where the outlet is, how to sort through it all, because Amazon can be sneaky tricksy sometimes. And of course, show you all my finds. I think we've got some really good ones. Like either this is gonna be my favorite video I've ever made or it's gonna be a complete disaster. Either way, I think it'll be very entertaining. <laughs> I'll be sure to link everything in the description below. Hopefully most of this is still on sale for you. Can't forget our 15 minute drill. I'm gonna give two $150 gift cards to a couple of you that drop a comment down below in the first 15 minutes that the video is up. So that a couple of you can go build a little baddie on a budget wardrobe or like a, a lawnmower or a fridge or something useful would be good too. <laughs> if you're late and you missed the 15 minute drill, make sure to turn on notifications so that you're here next time or Send me a text. My texting buddies always get a heads up. Disclaimer while I'm opening all of these. I'm not like frivolously buying stuff on Amazon every week. It really is just like a once in a while kind of thing for me. If I see a deal, I just can't pass up or if I really do need something like tomorrow. This video is mostly just to help people that need options when purchasing from like Patagonia or Athleta just isn't an option right now. Amazon's hidden outlet is overflowing with everything from prom dresses to activewear, tech stuff, houseware, and everything in between. Make sure to watch till the end because there is lots of good leggings coming. Some of the hardest things for me to spend money on are like nice going out dresses and swimsuits because I know I'm only gonna wear them a couple of times a year. So I made sure to get some of that kind of stuff too. Well, let's get started. Let's start with dresses because I was genuinely surprised to see like really nice looking dresses in this outlet. We're gonna start with this one. It's called the Ho Volta Women's Sequin Prom Backless Party Dress Glitter Rose Gold Spaghetti Strap Evening Dress Club Wear Mini Dress. <laughs> This was $7.99 and it was prime, which means free shipping. I made sure that all of this was prime because what's the point in paying $10 for an item if you have to pay $20 in shipping to get it? I got a medium in this, but can we talk about this little disclaimer? Because I didn't see this until after I'd already purchased it. We recommend size fits best women below 120 pounds. That ain't me, so we'll see how this goes. I don't think I've ever seen a weight requirement on clothes. So this dress got very mixed reviews, everything from cute and sexy all in one five stars to just bad. <laughs> if it looks half as good as it does on her in this picture, then I will be thrilled. <laughs> Let's see. Okay, first of all, Miss 120 pound only description. Hi, I'm 50 pounds heavier than that and I think I look phenomenal. So there's that. Picture this without black underwear. <laughs> And also some sort of backless bra. The sparkly fabric is stunning. It's pretty darn short on this side though. <laughs> I have absolutely nowhere to be wearing this as a 25 year old woman that doesn't go out ever, but. Um, well, do you maybe wanna go to Cheesecake Factory with me this weekend? Yeah. Okay, cool. I really am pleasantly surprised by it because it's actually very, very cheaply made. Very thin material. So you definitely want like some stuff under it. I'm pretty similar to the photo. Like I'm not feeling like they lied to me. Okay, since that one was like so cheap, we have to make up for it. This one was a little bit above the budget. It was $24. It's the most expensive thing in this whole haul because I loved it. Okay, speaking of a good deal though, because I know you're watching this because you like to get good deals. You know when you're shopping online and you go to the checkout and the little box pops up that's like, put gift card here or discount code here. And sometimes you're like, I wish I had a discount code. This app that I'm about to tell you about is going to change your life if you don't have it. It's called Honey. Honey is the sponsor of today's video, but I have been using them for like over three years now. It has saved me so much money, so much headache trying to find discount codes. So when you're shopping on one of your favorite sites like Lululemon, Sephora, Target, Target, throwback to two YouTube videos ago with Fashion Nova. I actually saved a couple extra bucks because uh, Honey found me a code. Saving me money because we love Fashion Nova. When you're at checkout, the little Honey Buddy will pop up. It searches the entire internet for every code that exists for that site and then automatically applies the best one to your cart. Those of you who have downloaded it already using my link have found over $240,000 in savings. So if you want to get in on that, it's absolutely free. You can download it in just two clicks if you go to joinhoney.com slash hope. That's joinhoney.com slash hope. Happy shopping. Okay, back to this dress. The color, the subtle print, the fit. I'm excited about it. It's called the 
the Matilli Women's Split V-neck Ruffle Long Sleeve Polka Dot Casual Loose Swing Short Dress. <laughs> It got pretty good reviews, and the customer photos in the review section were pretty promising, so. Okay, this though. This is so cute. Last one, cute but not so wearable, but this one, I'll be wearing all spring, all summer. This is adorable. Length is cute, the color's cute. This tag is not cute. Possibly a little sheer still, because this is just mesh, and then the skirt underneath is just mesh as well, so. This one was $24 well spent. <laughs> so how to find this mysterious outlet? I can't seem to find it on the site, just like scrolling through the menus. So I actually go into Google, type an Amazon outlet, and then click on it that way. And then it just takes you to the Amazon outlet homepage, and then has all of the sections there. It even has an under $10 section. So I'm gonna show you in a second how I narrowed it down to get some good stuff. Moving on to some more casual clothes. I didn't get a lot of these because I'm gonna be honest, if I'm not wearing activewear, I'm wearing sweats or maybe a dress. On TikTok, all of the cute trendy girls are wearing corsets. I got some freeze dried candy to try. Peach drinks, this is my favorite candy. Look how big it is. And not like the <laughs> scary crush your guts lace up ones, like these really just cute, more for looks corsets. So I found one for $6.99. It's called the Women's Sexy Lace Crop Slim Leotard Cami Sleeveless Strap Tank Top Backless Summer See-Through Camisole Top. I feel like there's some words in that title that shouldn't be there, but that's, that's what it is. So this one actually wasn't prime, but it was $6.99 and shipping was still free and it only took like a week to get here, so. All of these regardless of the color or the size are all $6.99, which is a pleasant surprise because that's what I mean by Amazon tries to be tricky. <laughs> it's kind of like if you've ever been on Wish's website where they'll advertise a price, but it's only for one specific color of a specific size, and it's usually not your size. <laughs> so I found the category on the outlet store that I wanted to go to, and then first and foremost, you want to select your budget and your size. That way, everything that's popping up is for sure gonna actually fit you for the dollar amount that it's advertising. Okay, I also found these shorts because we're getting into shorts season here. The Vacantion Women's Casual Elastic Waist Cotton Chino Cargo Shorts with Pockets. They were $10.49. Okay, we need to talk about the sizing situation though. <laughs> the black larges were the only ones that were on sale, so that's what I got. But it said a USA large is equal to a 5XL Asian. Can somebody confirm if that's real? I mean, I know that there's a little bit of a size difference, but five sizes. <laughs> All right, the corset is really little, like not circumference wise, but I expected it to come down a little further. I'm afraid to take my bra off. Let's try it. Oh, it's not bad. Zero support. Like there's no, nothing built in, not even removable cup pads. So that's what it looks like in the back. It's not bad. Does it feel like a $6.99 corset? Yeah, it does. <laughs> but it's, uh, it's what I expected though. I feel like in the pictures, the mesh layer looked a little bit more drapey and pretty. This one's just literally like, they just slapped a layer of mesh on the top. <laughs> the shorts are obviously a little big. I probably would have benefited from getting a medium or even a small, but I like the length of the shorts, the fabric, almost a win if it were the right size. Moving on to swimwear. This is a huge section in the outlet. So if you are looking for a deal on swimwear, this is a good place to go. Amazon swimwear in general though, you kind it's like a trial and error. Like buy a few of them knowing you're gonna send a couple of them back. Cause it's just hard to tell till you actually get them. So these are both from the same brand, but I got them separately. Relicaga. This is the Women's V Wire Bando Bikini Top. That's like the first normal title we've had. It was $9.35 for the top. I got a medium. I knew this was either gonna be really good or really bad based on the price. It feels pretty good. Like it actually does have a wire in here holding that little V in place. Removable cup pads, which is good cause <laughs> <laughs> White swimsuits are scary. And to go with the top, same brand, women's high-waisted tummy control swimsuit bottoms. So these sound incredibly promising, right? I got a medium. It's double lined. Okay, this isn't bad. For less than $20, I'm actually pretty impressed. Like, why is this swimsuit more supportive than half of the ones I own? that I spent like $50 on. <laughs> Quality wise, we definitely have a couple little issues to be expected with the white $9 bikini top. <laughs> you can obviously kind of see the cup pads and then it's like this V wire needed to like come up higher. But overall, exceeded my expectations. If you just look at me from a distance and squint a little bit, it is 
fire. Yeah, it doesn't look quite as good as it looks on her, but pretty close. The bottoms though, I really can't complain. The material feels pretty nice, pretty full coverage bottom. I really like these. Active wear, oh my goodness, I went crazy in this section. <laughs> it has been a hot minute since I've done an Amazon active wear haul, hasn't it? I used to do those all the time. I don't, I just, I love finding you guys affordable active wear, because I just think back to when I was in college, and I literally did not have $30 for leggings. I had like three pairs of those $11 Forever 21 leggings that I would just rotate between until they would get holes in them. So I'm really excited to have some ultra affordable options for you. <laughs> Speaking of not having $30. This was $30. <laughs> this actually wasn't supposed to be part of the video. I just got it because like I said earlier, it was one of those things where it was so cute, too good of a deal to pass up. Okay, so do you remember? I did a bow and tee review a couple months ago. They had a ton of cute brown stuff, but most of it was sold out. And then they had one top in particular that I fell in love with. It was really the only thing I loved from the haul and it was the one with the cute cut out front. Well, look what we have here. Cut out front and it's brown. And it was $30 for the whole set. So 15 bucks a piece. This is the Fafoa? Fafofa. Workout outfit for women, two piece, ribbed seamless crop tank, high-waisted yoga legging set. <laughs> Once again, I knew it was gonna either be really good or really bad. And let me tell you, when I say it feels exactly like the bow and tee stuff, like, it has some weight to it. It's not just your thin, flimsy, typical $15 active wear. The only thing is I'm pretty sure you can't pick like a size for the top and a size for the bottom. So I just got the medium. I'm actually blown away by this. Amazing. The length is good too. Ignore my goofy looking socks. The waistband is nice and compressing. The bra has removable cut pads and actually feels quite supportive. All right, I had to do a little side by side here. It's so similar, it's insane. I'm normally a small top and a medium bottom, but the medium set fits perfect. Fortunately, they do only have small, medium, large. That is the downside to this. There are seven colors. They all range from 30 to $34. All right, we're gonna squat test these. On one side, I'm gonna be wearing them with a nude pair of underwear. And on the other, I'm gonna be wearing the print. Okay, back to our under 10 finds. This listing was the weirdest ever, but it's from Running Girl, which I actually have been purchasing from on Amazon for years, so I knew I could kind of trust it. <laughs> Here's why it's confusing. So this is obviously a sports bra, but the listing title is butt lifting leggings for women, high-waisted seamless yoga compression, pants, tummy control gym workout tight. Ah, uh, and then when you click on it, there's bras, leggings, shorts. There's a lot happening in there. <laughs> but the deal specifically was on this sports bra in red wine in a size medium. It's super meshy, which I love. So I think it's gonna be really breathable. It was $12.59. So <laughs> I wouldn't say the sports bra run small. It's just not as stretchy as a typical sports bra, which is interesting. <laughs> Has removable cut pads, the little mesh details. Oh, look at the back. Oh, that's really cool. Honestly, I feel like you could probably find something similar at like TJ Maxx for $9.99. So it's not like an out of this world unheard of deal, but it's exactly what I expected. Good little sports bra for the price. Why are these brand names so hard to say? I'm not even going to try for that. Butt lifting workout seamless legging, scrunch butt yoga, pants squat proof workout tight. They were $8.78. I think that's like literally the cheapest I've ever gotten leggings for on Amazon. I went with a large because this color terrifies me. <laughs> Are they gonna be sheer? Most definitely, but very much navigation vibes, but they also have the booty scrunch. Dang it. I wish so badly for these to work, but first of all, they're definitely too big. <laughs> Second of all, they are like painfully see-through. Like, you know it's bad, when you squat test them with nude underwear and they still fail miserably. <laughs> it's such a shame because the color is beautiful. The booty scrunch is actually doing a pretty good job. But yeah, these just aren't working. They are good enough that I would say if you got a darker color and your size, I think you'd like them. They're not too terribly expensive full price. I just want a yellow seamless legging that isn't sheer. Is that too much to ask? <laughs> All right, if you're not a legging fan, I have some other bottoms for you. Boot cut, high-waisted, they are the Keo Lorne? Keo Lorne. But the bag has a different name on it. Boot cut yoga pant for women. High waisted workout pants for women. Tummy control bootleg work pant dress pants. These were $10.70. I love this green. These are a medium, but they actually had a really great size range. They go from an extra small to a 3XL. They feel good though. Like the fabric, definitely the best feeling fabric out of them all so far. Okay, these are good. Really good length. 
The color's awesome, the fit is awesome. This one does also have the elastic waist at the top. And then it does have a waistband pocket in the front, which is weird, usually this is in the back. Super cute. Here's a squat test on these in case you wanna like wear them to yoga class or whatever, but these would be just the best little casual pant. We've got some tops. Bestie Sun workout long sleeve. Shirts backless top exercise. Clothes athletic wear for women. <laughs> okay. This was $9.99, there were tons of colors. Got it in a medium. And it's like a looser fitting long sleeve top and then it has this little tie back detail. Okay, this isn't bad. Oh wait, that's actually really cute with the sports bra under it. Like it's basic, but nice material. It's really soft and stretchy. This is nice. I feel like it would be pretty, oh, it does have thumb holes. I think we might like this top better. This one's also from the Bestie Sun brand. And this one was 1079. I like the fit of this one, at least with the sports bra. I kind of liked the back of the other one better. These are cute though. Like genuinely, if you just have 10 bucks and you want a workout top. Okay, I don't know if this next one is necessarily a gym top, but we are treating it as such because it was in that category in the outlet. Susapang, woman's sexy long sleeve backless crop top ruche self tie open back slim fit t-shirts. This was 947. Got it in a size small. That color, the neck hole is interesting. It's just like a raw edge. They cut it. It's not sewn or anything. Okay, this one's a no for me. First of all, it's really see-through, so you'd have to wear some type of bra. And I couldn't find a bra that like wouldn't look super weird with the back of it because it's so open. This is a cute design. Like I actually love the design. I think it is meant to be worn without anything under it to give that backless look. But this situation. <laughs> isn't working for me. This is just, it's like your basic t-shirt material. So it's not gonna be nice to work out in. This is definitely more like a going to a concert at the beach kind of top. Love the color. Love the whole thing in theory, really. It just, last but not least, we have some shorts. I don't know why shorts were a little bit harder to find. Maybe because they're like in season. Um, <laughs> listen, this was the print that was on sale, okay? On sale for $9.99. The Hop Go, biker shorts for women, high-waisted, print seven inch yoga shorts, workout cycling, compression comfy, pants tights. <laughs> if these are good though, they actually did have some really cute animal print ones for like $14.99. These are size medium. <laughs> I don't know, I don't know what's going on. Have a nice day. Other than that, it's not even in English. <laughs> okay, wait, these aren't bad at all. They're really loud, but like the fabric is great. The fit's pretty good. It does have the elastic waistband, but I don't know. It's not really bothering me on these. They do kind of dig into the thigh a little bit at the bottom and they're a little bit longer than I would like. I think like five or six inches is actually my ideal inseam because on me, that's where it hits about mid thigh. Yeah, these aren't bad. Like I said, they had some like animal printy ones that I think would actually be really nice. So is the Amazon outlet worth it? Honestly, yeah. I actually really liked most of the stuff that I found. Leo and I picked out some other videos and put them down below that we think you might enjoy. And we'll see you guys in the next video. Say bye, YouTube. Well, Leah, I got something for you at the outlet too. It's a blanket. Leo's had the same blanket for like two years. <laughs> oh.